great. So I thought it's been a rough few weeks and let's go on a field trip. So, the recipe that we're going to shop for is something called Nuka Zuke. And it's particularly interesting because it is like a fermented um, pickled vegetable, but what you use fermented is rice bran. Uh, today we're gonna go to Japan Center because if you are in a country that does not produce rice, such as the UK, apparently finding rice bran or like fresh rice bran that hasn't been treated with anything, uh, extremely hard. Really what I did here was um, the only way to get fresh rice bran. There's a, there's a store called Japan Center. We've been to it together before. And I guess if you buy their brown rice, they have a machine in there that separates the rice from the rice bran for you. And so I guess that's the only way to get rice bran. car was so close. Two percent. Two percent. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Thank you so much. Ah, uh, yes, please. <laughs> Actually, I, I did this for that. <laughs> so much rice. Let's see. Is that 88? See that? 88 grams. So 88 grams including the bag. So I'm going to just put this at like 80, 80, 85. So as rice bran, it's like I need some daikon radish, I need some carrots. So it's actually um, a lot of different ingredients. And so I think this grocery trip may be quite fun because it will be taking you to a lot of places in London. So, uh, so. So right now I'm going off to Whitechapel Market, which is East London. It's by um, the East London Mosque, uh, but it's really neat because it's just these like open markets. It's very 
It's very down to earth. It's nothing like fancy, like you would think for London, like, oh, it's so pretty, it's so quaint. It's very much like a working market. A working market. It's very much a working market, which is what I, uh, which is what I like. Down there is uh, something from the Elizabeth line. So it's a newer line, which makes it look like the rest of the like subway stations in Asia. It's like much cleaner. It has air conditioning and everything's nice. Okay. So I love coming here to like shop for all of the kitchen like kitchen gadget wear and stuff, but like you'll have clothes. Um, you have like shops and stuff, like there's food shops, but there's also like grocery stores. So um, you have a lot of like people from Bangladesh here. So a lot of like South Asian foods and stuff. <laughs> White Chapel fried chicken. So there's like actual grocery stores, but the one that I'm looking at is just out on the road. But I do see Muli already, so two for two for one fifty. I mean, in general, it's so much better to get like the produce that they have here because it's just, I feel like it's better quality and um, the price, it's like a lot better. So, yeah, like, see some of these, like these guys are out here since like, oh, one time I was out at like six o'clock and they were, sh they were here already, so. saw that I didn't have enough rice bran so I found this like natural I mean I didn't find it a uh, natural food store that I normally go to sell oat bran uh, not sure if it functions the same because you guys know like oatmeal is gonna be probably a lot sweeter I don't know if it gets gummy like oatmeal but I'm thinking maybe if it's just like the bran on the outside maybe it'll be uh, quite similar so Working over there now. Brick Lane today. A lot of things are still closed, but people are still out. Earl of East is nice too. They have some like really cute, um, like kitchen wear and like candles and stuff like that. Here it is. So this was at the end. I literally, I, I saw it and then it passed by. So there's oat bran, 350 grams. And I think a bag should be fine. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if this is gonna work. Let's try it. So I hope you all enjoyed that vlog and be sure to stay tuned for when I actually make the Nuka uh, Zuke and Nuka Doko recipe because uh, it's been quite fun to smell and see as it is fermenting. And um, if you do want to support the channel, uh, we do have a Patreon. I always put the uh, link in the description box. So uh, it's always a big help and thank you so much for watching and I will see you all again next time. Bye. I can't